apartment buildings up. Doesn't have any residents right now, though. Um, I don't know. I'm thinking I could move this research lab to here. And if I remove the stone garden, I could set up a, um, a university here. That would probably be a good idea, considering seem to be running out of specialists Break down here. Discovered. Printed the electronics, right, I remember that. So this will uh, allow drone prefabs to be constructed in the drone assembler using metals instead of electronics. We don't have drone, well, there's drone printing. But uh, I'm going to wait on that for a while. Okay, so if I move this stone guard, well, they're not going to be happy about that, really. Service building not working, shopping. Relaxation's full, dining's full, shopping's full, thing is full. This is just not spectacular right now. Um, okay, Sector I want scan. to set up research lab here, and then move this. Oh, okay, the end of an age. Our last living founder, spelling the end of an era for us all. Okay, Saki Oda has died of old age. That was our last founder. Rest in peace, friend. And um, we have a new... Uh, oh, hang on. I should do this first because the event's going to mess things up, I think. So once I land this rocket... Okay, the heavenly storm. Mission control got an update on the status of the meteor storms and it's not looking good okay the initial evaluation of the situation with the meteor clusters had been miscalculated the scientists from the near earth object detection programs predict that a significant amount of the meteorite stream would fill the space between mars and earth while the thick atmosphere of our home world would protect it from eventual impacts the threat level for any spacecraft will be past tolerable to address the new situation earth control has canceled all space flights until further notice so rockets will not arrive until the situation with the meteor impacts is resolved. Inbound rockets will still land on Mars. Okay. We must maintain strict regulations over our supplies until then. So I don't know if that means we can't do this right now or what. Um, I'm going to send this dozer over to work on that. And let's see if I can get one of those unknowns, maybe. I don't know if I will, though. Well... Let's see. Okay, let's try Project Trophy. We'll send our RC Explorer. See if that works. I I'm just curious, to be honest. Because, again, this is... This is actually one of the... The mysteries that I hadn't experienced. Although I got to this point in the recording session that failed, so... Well, your fingers are crossed that it doesn't mess up again. Okay, it looks like, yeah, these might be grounded. Okay, the meteor storm is uh, going on. And it's out over here this time, so I guess I lucked out with the randomness this time, not having a meteor spawn right over my water thing, my water extraction. Okay, it uh, looks like I was able to launch this. Um, what if I move that there? Maybe I need a... I may need a polymers storage depot out here. So that... Yeah, there... Now the drones are actually going to grab more polymers from this. Okay, so will the rocket... Well, this rocket should leave now. There we go. Duty never ends. Attention is required. We've discovered the crashed remains of another expedition. It seems that an unknown colony had sent an ill-prepared expedition team to this location. Their equipment failed and they never managed to return to their home. We've identified the remains of several colonists who lost their lives in the line of duty. Alright, two options. We can bury them and then salvage their useful equipment and we'd get 5,000 research and five drone prefabs. Or we can bring the remains here and we'll bury them with honors, and all colonists would gain 20 morale for t 10 souls. 
two good options. But I think I want the research. Research complete. Because that now gives storage time. compression. And uh, now we have a lot more. Um, oh, that might have, oh, I guess that was because of the meteor strike. Uh, but yeah, storage compression. We now have a lot more storage for water and oxygen. Which should help once the dust storm hits in one in about a soul. I wonder how much progress are we... Yeah, we're doing emergency training. What's this? Ooh, arcology. Oh, but I should get sustainable architecture, I think. There are earth -sick colonists. Oh, whoops. Maybe I should have gone with the morale boost instead. Comfort zero. No service building gaming. Well then, maybe I should build an electronics store. I would use some electronics though. Alright. Oh, okay, and I can bring this rocket in, although I think this means that the Earth's colonist is gonna board it immediately. Yeah. Oh wait, I think. Oh, the no, this, that was the, the uh, Ilfe expedition, that the the planetary anomaly. Okay, cool. All right, uh, let's allow some exports. And uh, so that we can get some metals back. Although we can't bring any supplies until the meteor storms end, which is going to be a couple of souls. Well, we should be able to rely on what we have for the moment, but um, shuttle heavy load. Well, maybe I need to build some more shuttles then. I'll start with one more. We should have, yeah, some electronic. well, yeah, there's some electronics down here, some polymers down here. Okay, I don't think anyone's asking. I don't think anyone's producing enough machine parts and that want concrete. So let's go back to asking for polymers in exchange for concrete. Because we might be able to get some more for that. Uh, oh, this Hame Mel's extractor is depleted now. So I can salvage that. And lichen sprang pretty nicely. Ah, IMM is offering us polymers for our 50 concrete. So I'll accept that. And then I want to salvage this stretch of, yeah, because it's not a great idea to have extra cables lying around. Um, oh, let me move my RC commander to here. Maybe they'll help load this a bit faster. I may need to set up the next dome here a bit sooner. I mean, we've got lots of water. Maybe I could do that now. Although, well, we're about to get hit with a dust storm, so there's no point in doing that because I can't bring in colonists. Idle extractor? Okay, that concrete extractor's depleted. And dust storm. And then I can remove this stretch of cable, I guess try and reduce the risk of it taking damage and getting weeks. There we go. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we have a lot... We're losing a lot less water now thanks to the water extractor. And, uh... Yeah, we're still losing... Still losing about the same amount of oxygen, but we're doing fine. Oh, right! I forgot to t say this this time. I did research. I looked at the the wiki for surviving Mars uh, on Paradox wikis, and yes, ranches are part of Project Laika expansion, because that's the one with all the um, all the animals and stuff. So, yeah, if you want an alternative to hydroponics, bays, and farms, purchase Project Laika, and you can grow turkeys and geese and chickens and rabbits. And other Sector and large standard. livestock as well. Ah, uh, good emergency training. Okay, so what are? Okay, we're doing mega storage now. Uh, there's the Institute of Science. I would like to get a science dome set up. The problem is, maybe I would put it. I could put it here. 
Ooh, I could set up some more large dumping grounds out here, I think, now. Now that this is depleted. And... Okay, now hopefully the drones should take all this waste rock from here and put it here. At least that's what I'm hoping for. Okay, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but if you've got a landing pad, you can convert it to a trade pad. And you can convert trade pads to landing pads, so... Okay, where are we? Oh, out, the, out here somewhere. Alright. Oh, right, forestation plants don't work during a uh, dust storm, so we're not getting lichen right now. Oh, well. Okay, but how are people? Social, missing drinking, social's not working, relaxation is full. So I guess I need another park here, or maybe just a small space bar. Although, well, we have a lot of, we have some vacant work slots and some vacant residential slots. Okay, let, yeah, let, let's set up a small space bar. Yes, that, that would give some social... Wait, dining is full? Okay, never mind. Let's... Maybe I'll set up a diner instead of a space... Although... Although, yeah, people are missing drinking. Okay, so I get... Yeah, I'll, I'll go ahead and set up a space bar. Small one. And, yeah, that should also give some relaxation as well. Yeah, relaxation, drinking, and social. Oh, right. There's space out here as well. I can set up another park, and I'd still have three more hexes for something. Uh, so... We're low on oxygen. That's not good. Let's set up a garden... here. And we still have... Why is it not getting repaired? That sh shouldn't that be within range of the... Well, if not, let's uh, move a drone commander. Try and get it within range. It should be... Yeah, it is within range of the thing. I just don't know... It is within range of the drone hub. I just don't understand why it's... Well, there. It's done. Uh, we're down to 114 oxygen. So that should be enough. I hope. Where's the meteor storm? That did not show me where it is. Okay, it looks like it's up here. Yeah. That's fine. That's fine for now. Ooh, brace for impact. All stations on red alert. Unidentified object on course for direct impact. Mission control, our sensors are detecting a large object incoming at high velocity. Judging by the data from our telemetry, its mass and speed are great enough to cause major damage on the surface. It would be wise to evacuate the area around the projected point of impact. We could be wrong, but our initial visual readings on the object show that it has an unconventional form for a meteorite. Strange protrusions can be observed from the back of the object. Could this be something different than a meteor? A major impact is expected to happen somewhere on Mars. Stay focused and don't jump to conclusions. Okay, so impact in nine hours... Dust storm will end in nine hours, and dome is without life support. Oh, come on, why, why can't we fix these leaks? Session Especially 10. since we've got multiple leaks. Well, this is bad. I, well, I have plenty of water, but I guess I guess I'll shut down fuel refineries again for now, but. Suffocation's going to be the major problem. Although the dust storm is going to end soon, they can just survive a few more hours without oxygen. A tall order, I know, but. Okay, the dust storm is over. Um, and Dredger's grounding day. Planetfall. Finally, get a visual on the target as the dust settles. No one at Mission Control can believe their eyes. We haven't seen anything like it, and it doesn't look like something man made. I don't want to overstate things, but this could be a first contact situation. Let's see what we can see. 